Bluetooth operates at 2.4 gigahertz, the same as your Wi-Fi router. That is a very high frequency, whereas your Wi-Fi router connects to the network, the internet, the outside world. Bluetooth, guys, is a protocol between devices. So go under settings, and under Bluetooth, you can see the devices that are available, that are ready to pair. Well, these three right here all belong to me, but just, I'll show you what happens. Like this one down here, the Samsung soundbar, it's showing that I'm pairing with it, and it shows that I can connect to that, guys, but that doesn't belong to me, and that is obviously someone in my building, so I don't want that to show up under my connected devices. I've even had people try to connect to me on Bluetooth. Has that ever happened to you where you're on your laptop or your phone and you say, someone's, this Bluetooth device is trying to pair with you. Do you want to accept? That's happened to me before, but I'm going to click under settings right here. And for anything that you don't want to show up, guys, under your available devices, just click unpair and then that's going to drop down you can see that way you can stay safe with bluetooth if this did not pair restart bluetooth under whatever device you know like if this wasn't pairing just um either turn on bluetooth or sometimes unpair that like if i unpair this right now and say unpair now it, this just told me my your phone is disconnected. Now I'm gonna hit Palm Gear Reflex again. So it just told me your Palm Gear device is connected. Enjoy. So again, guys, go onto your Bluetooth settings. Make sure you're pairing the right device that you want to share data with. And if it's not pairing, restart the first device that you paired with. And then go back and restart the second one. And it will work. Okay? As I say, it can be finicky in that regard. If this tip has helped you, please post a comment below. It really means a lot. And thanks for watching.